That is too stuck. Oh, the end rod's going off. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, getting ready to head down to Orange Beach. I am running a guided surf fishing trip. Got a group coming down from Michigan to meet me there this evening. But if you are interested in booking a guided surf fishing trip right here along the Alabama Gulf Coast, give me a holler, look me up at g2coastal.com and we will get you out there and we'll get on some fish. Let's go ahead and see what we can get into this evening. Jordan, this is my wife, Mandy. Hi, Mandy. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm terrible with names, so it's okay. it's all if fine. I just yell, hey you, you'll have to guess which one I'm talking to, all right? Mandy, okay. Mandy and Mike and... It don't matter. <laughs> We're gonna throw some sand fleas out there this evening. Oh, okay. Yeah. I actually gathered these up on a trip I ran yesterday. The little spot we were on was loaded with them, so I stocked up. And right here, you can see that outflow of water going out there. We've got a little bit of a rip current. Yeah, I see that. Just dragging that water out. We're hoping that's gonna pull some bait and stuff out. Fish will wanna come up through this little trough. This area that runs parallel to the beach is the trough. Yeah. So we're hoping fish will come in here, make a little loop in this trough, and come back out, and we'll catch a few. Sweet. And that's the plan. I'm just going to kind of stagger these. I'm going to keep a couple in close over here, too. Okay. Because there's a chance those fish will run up and through that little trough, so I'll keep a couple okay. in there. Uh, yeah. Here. Yeah, that little deeper strip of water yeah. that runs there. Yeah. Yep. Fish will come up in that. But I'm gonna throw one more out a good little ways and we ought to be set. Yeah, these are Sputnik sinkers. These are gonna hold in the rough water really well. They won't drag around. And when we reel them in, these arms will break loose. Okay. That'll dig into the sand and then when you reel them in, they fall down. Nice. Reel in nice and easy. Yeah, start, start reel that in. You don't have to set the hook. Yeah. I was just getting ready to say the reason I'm shifting down because we've kind of got that convergence of those two ribs right there. Yeah. Yeah, that's a solid fish. Yeah, keep reeling. Keep reeling. You don't you don't want to give them very much slack, especially if it's a pompano. Those pompano just get a little bit of slack. Keep reeling fast, keep real reeling, fast. Honey. Real, real fast. There you go. I'm gonna tighten that drag down real quick. Okay, keep going. Yeah, if you're reeling and you don't feel anything, that fish is probably just swimming right back at you at that point. Real fast when you don't feel any tension. You have to keep that rod tip up just like you are. You're doing great. You're doing really good with this. I, I'm not sure how far out we are. I'm trying to find the line. Because once we get so close, I'll have you start walking backwards and we'll walk that fish back. Oh, yeah. That looked like a pump. Pump roll? Yeah. Start walking backwards with it. Keep that rod tip up and walk backwards. Keep walking back. There we go. Keep walking back. Keep walking back. There we go. Good fish. That's a real good. That's a good pump. There we go. Right, that's that's a, what we that's want. A keeper too, isn't it? Oh yeah, he's an O doubter. What is that? That's a pompano. Oh, that's All right, what I'm gonna take about. this Locking over down. here. Oh. Squeezing. Oh, hold on tight. Hold on. <laughs> that's all right. I'm gonna flip him back around. Do the okay around the tail, and then take your fingers and squeeze him really tight on the gills. You're keeping him, right? Yeah. So don't worry about hurting him. Heck yeah. Right. Now I'm gonna take a picture real quick. Maybe if my hands, I'm gonna wipe the sand off my hands and take a picture. Awesome. That's a nice one. Yeah, that's a solid pomp right there. Nice. Hold on to it. Yep. Keep that rod tip up because that's probably another pomp. Yeah, that guy hit hard. Yeah, I like when those rods really get to bouncing. You used to reel them with your right hand. I've always reeled with my left hand, so I can't do it that way. Yeah, that fish is running down that way down the beach, so we've we've probably got another good pompano on. In fact, reel and walk this way, but keep reeling. Don't let any slack get in that line. Real fast, real fast. And we'll, yeah, and we'll just kind of walk towards him. All right, trying to find the line in the water. Yeah, just keep reeling. We got to keep tension on that. Keep that raw tip up a little bit more if you can. It's getting close. Okay, if you want, kind of start walking backwards and, and, and keep keep that raw tip up and walk backwards with him. Keep, go back go back fast now go back fast there we go that's another keeper i'll just trade you squeeze him tight you ain't gonna hurt him you're gonna eat him all right now hold on to him quit dropping him squeeze him there you go <laughs> i'm gonna tighten that drag down just oh maybe maybe let me tighten that down just a hair. That's a good fish right there. Yeah, that's a 
That's a solid fish right there. He's pulling drag, man. Is he? Yeah. Yeah, that is a really solid fish right there. Yeah, that's got to be another pomp. Let's start walking down this way. Yeah, keep reeling. Yeah, now you're under that other line. You're good. Yeah, just keep reeling him in like that, though. Like, I keep my drags loose, but he's the first one that's really pulled the drag like that. Now, I kind of start walking back, and we'll see if we can get... Yeah, keep that rod tip up. Keep keep tension on there. We'll see if we can pull him up. Oh, <laughs> yeah, dude. That is a solid pop. That is a tank. Holy dude. <laughs> Heck yeah, man. That is awesome. Yeah, that is a stud. Look, he, he's so old, he's got spots on him. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, let me get you flipped around here and get that hook out of there. Oh, oh easy. I got it, Oh, we, we're hooked up on that one. Let's just carry this over. It's dad. Uh, all right, this is what we were waiting on. We were waiting on all these pumps to show up tonight. No, oh, did he get off? No, keep reeling. Keep reeling in case he's swimming at you. Sometimes these fish will come at you and trick you. Oh, yeah, we're hooked up over there. All right, okay. Grab him by the tail. I'm going to go over there real quick. Dude, that is a stud pompano. Like, I'm pumped. Watch that hook. I'm going to get over here. All right. Yeah, keep walking him back. Keep, that's another stud. No, oh my God. That's, that's, an, that's another giant bomb. Oh my goodness. Holy cow. Jeez. That is two stud. Oh, the end rod's going off. Oh my goodness. All right. Huh? Yeah, toss him in that bucket. <laughs> They're over there fighting over that one. Oh my goodness. All right, okay. Reel that slack in. We'll, I'll carry him over there. Good night. We'll see if that's another problem. I'm gonna have a bucket full here in a moment. I'm gonna move that bucket away from the water. But we got a bunch of live pompano in there. Okay, I'm gonna help you with this. another pop, another pop. I tell you what, I think he's gonna be a keeper though. I think he's gonna hit 12. <laughs> Man, holy cow. That went from famine to feast in a heartbeat. Yeah, we'll, we'll measure him. The others are no doubters. Holy cow. Pop off dog. I think this guy's gonna hit 12 too. Oh yeah. He's 14, those monsters just made him look smaller. Yeah, uh, set that rod over there. Man, that got wild. Holy smokes, dude, those are studs. My goodness. That is awesome. awesome. All right, this evening did not start off on fire. We found a couple scattered out and then that school came through and it got absolutely wild. And, and that's how it goes sometimes. It goes from a fairly slow day to just an explosion. And that's exactly what happened this evening. But I am tired. I've got a lot of stuff to clean up. So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up. So until next time, I'll see you later.